Let's go to Central Mass, where a massive fire is under investigation in Northbridge. The flames destroyed a mansion that was an important piece of the town's history. NBC 10's John Maroney live in Northbridge for us with a look at how the community is reacting to this major loss. John? Corey, the good news is no one was hurt, but that fire did damage an important part of history here in town. It is a historic building, as you can tell. It's one of the old mansions in town. A big loss in Northbridge, the Oakhurst Manor ravaged by fire. The old mansion, a reminder of the town's past when textiles were king. It's very sad, very, very sad. People like myself that grew up in this town, we, we love the history of in the old white mansions. The fire broke out around 1 o'clock Friday morning and spread quickly on the upper floors. It took dozens of firefighters hours to get the flames under control, according to neighbors. Yeah, it was pretty scary. I mean, you know, the flames were coming kind of like behind my house, and I ran out, and obviously my concern was my children and my family. Seven people were living inside the home at the time, and all of them were able to get out safely. They're apparently artists that belong to the group A State of Mind. And uh, they were all part of, like, a collaborative group that was trying to rehab the property and create, like, a communal living type arrangement. The house itself was built in the 1890s by the Whiten family, which opened the first textile mill in Northbridge. The large sprawling home is one of several built by the family, but seems to be a favorite of people. It's just the attention to detail. You don't see that anymore. Oh, it's absolutely beautiful. It's stunning. Um, the woodwork is just, is, is incredible. We're back live. It's still unclear what will happen to the property. The cause of the fire still under investigation. We're live in Northbridge, John Maroney, NBC 10 Boston.